I am not crazy. <laughs> yes, you are. You're crazy. See? See? You proved it. Thank you. <laughs> Daddy's hair is short. Short. <laughs> We're missing. Very short. Is it keys? You think he's working in the mirror? <laughs> As Katie. Say hello. <laughs> hello, Katie. Say hello. Hello. Okay, there she. Hello. There you go, folks. She actually speaks. Hello. <laughs> it's so hard to get her to talk. Hello. The, oh, hi. There goes Timmy. Hello. <laughs> it's so hard to get her to talk when the camera's on. It's nice to hear you say hello. Oh, that tickles. So if you know us, you probably expected to see fireworks tonight. It's New Year's Eve, and the Chandlers and fireworks go together like peas and carrots. But it's not peas, happening. Peas and carrots. I don't know. That's a good point. <laughs> that's disgusting. Where did that phrase come from? Yuck. But we go together pretty well. And uh, we, but we were just so tired, quite honestly. Our Thanksgiving yeah. was spent packing, packing for India, stressing that I would have be over limit on weight, which we were, and we were, which we were. It's probably a funny story for another time about the those four uh, suitcases. suitcases. There's a lot of funny stories about the suitcases. But our Christmas uh, was we. I mean, it barely felt like Christmas, quite honestly. There yeah. was no time to relax. When we got back, we were so consumed by the adjustment of Cadence and our own adjustment and Melanie catching back up on school with Caleb and... Getting back into a family routine. When and you're not in routine <laughs> for two weeks, it takes a long yes. time, more than two weeks, to get back into a routine. So, mm -hmm. It might sound strange that adding one child... Um, would completely change your life around, but it really does. The old routine that we used to live out just didn't quite work. When you have a baby, you slowly get into a routine, and it it, like, it becomes more of like an accessory, for lack of a better word. <laughs> right. um, Definitely for the lack of a better yeah. word. Obviously, that infant's really valuable. But... Right, but you can tote it around anywhere, and it doesn't have an opinion, and it doesn't have, <laughs> right. you know... <laughs> the needs are basic. Right. When you add a seven-year-old, it's a little bit more complicated. She and definitely the family has dynamic, opinions. Yeah, and the family dynamic changes more drastically. Yeah, that by the time New Year's rolled around, the third holiday we've had to deal with in this season, Thanksgiving, Christmas, and now New Year's, we're just tired, quite honestly. And everyone is tired. You know, the kids weren't too interested in fireworks. They heard other people around us putting off fireworks, but... They were all out by 9 o'clock tonight. Melanie and I probably would have been out early tonight if uh, if we didn't have a tradition that we keep to every we year. We love our tradition. That's my favorite tradition of the whole year. And Caleb was really small. We were, it had been like, what, eight years ago, six years ago? I don't know, seven years ago probably. Um, we were like, what are we going to do for, for New Year's? And so what we would do is... The first year, we actually prayed through New Year's, end capping the year with just praising God and thanking Him for um, everything that He had done. And it's a really nice way of sometimes the like your schedule and life gets so hectic that you can't really remember things. Um, so mm. typically, what happens is we had talked about our tradition about going through celebration, and we talk about everything that happened the that year in celebration and our walk, and so. By New Year's, our, you know, it's fresh in our mind, all yep. the things that God has done. Um, and so it's a really nice way of just giving God a little bit of time 
and just focusing on what he, his goodness and his faithfulness and um, we I just love it. It's it's amazing. And and over the years that like the first year the prayer time probably <laughs> lasted about an hour and we were just we were like wow that was a really interesting way to ring in the new year just in prayer. And, um, you know, I, then it grew to where we would be just, we would just sit in the living room praying for hours. hours. Um, and it's, it's, it's just a wonderful way to reflect on the year in, in the quiet. Because what New Year's usually is, is loud. And for some people, it's drinking, and though we don't drink. And, and it's just, it's, parties it's partying. And... And, and that's great. That's fun. We've been to, <laughs> we've been to parties with friends, and it's, it's wonderful. It's, it's great to ring in the new year with friends. We realize that if we take that time with each other, just husband and wife, to pray, it made us really pause and reflect on every little thing um, that God had done that year. So much so that we realized we can't keep our eyes closed for and our heads bowed for four hours straight. So we had to turn off all the lights in the house. We're in darkness. Back. We're pitch black. <laughs> and and uh, we were even like covering up the little like time on the electronics, like <laughs> the DVR. Got to cover up the time on it because we don't want no light in the room, no distractions. And the kids are asleep. And it's a wonderful way to reflect just on God's goodness. So we're... um. You can probably hear the kids in the video. They're actually still awake, but we're getting ready um, to um, go pray. So we hope you had a wonderful 2017, and we hope you have a very prosperous and blessed 2018. Thank you to all of you who just continue to watch our channel and support us. It's, it's wonderful just to always read uh, comments of encouragement as we just continue to live our life and and enjoy it and uh, we're we hope you continue watching in 2018 we have a lot of actually interesting ideas for where to take our channel in 2018 a lot of the same old stuff fun stuff but some new ideas we're taught we've been tossing around and we so we hope you'll keep watching and enjoy that stuff and we'll see you next year happy new year